Hello Taurus, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. Now we have here New Moon and Aquarius open up to change. New moons are no new doors that are opening, so you have to be open to this. If you accept that, you know, things need to change and you, you need to move on, new opportunities will show up for you. White stag protector. White stag. You are an old soul. Your best friend is nature. Use your intuition to take you where you want to go. Awaken to the powerful force within you. You are meant to create blessings with your magic. So you can change direction here. You have that ability. If you listen to your intuition to turn things around and open your heart to change here. Now let's see what the guidance is. If this starts to resonate, please like, share and subscribe. The Ace of Wands. The Tower Moment. The Nine of Wands. The High Priestess. There's your intuition that the Spirit's talking about here. The overall central energy is the Ace of Pentacles. Now there's two Aces for brand new beginnings here. The Seven of Cups. The King of Swords. The Emperor energy, which is Aries energy, that might be relevant for some of you here. And the Two of Pentacles. Now, there is a tower moment here, and this is very challenging time for you. You've been going through one thing after another. You can feel battle, battle weary with this. Always try to understand, and it's very difficult, that this is a blessing in disguise. You've been stuck in something here. You've been fighting against the tide here. Change needs to happen and you're not going with it, the flow. So the universe has stepped in here and it's released you from something where there's no more growth. Now, you've been through a challenging time, but you're wiser now. You've learned here what suits you and what doesn't. These are karmic lessons you've learned. So it's time now to use the wisdom that you've gained. Listen to your intuition. Accept these tower moments as blessings in disguise. After the tower moment comes the star card, which is new hope and rejuvenation, which the universe is wanting for you. So you've been fighting against the tide and the universe has said no more. This isn't working out. We want the best for you. So it's time to listen to your intuition. Believe that you can create better things here. There's something else that would work out better. There's a new place you could be at that would serve you better, a better environment. There could be a new way of doing things. There could be new relationships, new jobs out there that you could be looking at. But because you're not accepting change, the universe has stepped in and created this tower moment and it can feel very scary. They want you to listen to your intuition here. Your intuition is going to be your guide. It's a powerful force that's within you. You are meant to create blessings in your life and what you've been in was not a blessed situation. So if you listen to your intuition here, you're going to be able to weigh things up here and look at your options. This is about bringing blessings into your life, creating blessings. So this is about your choices that you've made. You've, you're wiser now. You can make better choices for yourself in the future. You're looking at these options. Do not procrastinate. Don't take too long. This tower moment is designed to move you forward. It's about weighing things up. It could do, to be, like I say, to do with work, finances, relationships or environments. It can be that you've taken on too much. You've been juggling too much. So you might have to balance that out. It could be finding that balance between work and play for a lot of you as well. But you're finding that better way going forward, that more sensible way. You're making sensible choices because you're looking at the opportunities or the options that you have because you've got the wisdom to do it now. The universe is saying you're wise enough now. What they're wanting you to do is they're wanting you to take up new opportunities for stability that are more stable than what you've been in, that will serve you better, and also things that you're going to enjoy because that's, there's not been a lot of pleasure or passion in what you've been investing in. So this could be new relationships, new places to live, new study courses, new jobs, new purchases. There could be new contracts here, new study courses. Whatever it is, it's going to benefit you because you're going to enjoy it. So look at your options carefully here. Weigh up your situation about how you want to go forward. Make choices with regards to what your heart and soul is telling you, things you're going to enjoy, and things that are going to improve your stability in life. So it could be going towards better paid jobs, going to courses that bring in better paid employment. There could be windfalls and inheritances here as well that help you take up something you're passionate about. But this is a heartfelt thing. It's time now to 
to understand here that you should be creating things that you enjoy. That's where success comes from. So this here could be you seeing clearly, you're listening to your intuition here about the more productive path you need to go down. You're making that choice that suits you best, that you're passionate about. It could be you speaking up. It could be you seeking advice, whether it be financial, professional, legal advice of any kind. But you're ready to look to the future now. And what you're doing here is you're taking control of things. Now, it can be a tower moment where it's moving you away from somebody who's controlling or has been controlling you, whether it be controlling bosses uh, or controlling partners. So this is an Aries energy. It represents Aries. Or this could be you getting in that driving seat and making well-disciplined well-balanced choices, weighing things up in a, in a sensible way here so that you can go and create something that's going to be prosperous. So it's about you taking that initiative here to go forward and accept change and understand that change is needed. So you can go forward here to build your own empire. Emperors build empires. There's great things you could be building here. So this is a blessing in disguise, this tower moment. I know it might not feel like that. But trust your intuition will guide you forward. You're meant to be creating blessings in your life. You're meant to be enjoying everything you're investing in. Wish wisely. Wish wisely, you see. Use your wishes wisely to manifest your heart's desire and take practical steps towards making your dreams come true. And really, that is what this is all about. Okay, I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.